There are huge concerns about the San Francisco 49ers defense going into Super Bowl 58. Defensive coordinator Steve Wilkes ripped his defense performance against the Detroit Lions in the NFC Championship where their effort was called into question. And you're going up against one of the greatest quarterbacks in NFL history this Sunday. This is definitely something that you don't want to hear going into the biggest game of the season. You see, this is the end of the line. This is the finish line. What you are is who you are. It's not a mistake of what transpired against the Detroit Lions. This is who the 49ers defense is and what they have been all season long. A team that looks insanely talented on paper, but underachieves on the field. Chase Young, haven't even heard of this dude since he got traded by the Washington Commanders for what I thought was a bag of Cheetos and a flat soda. When it turns out the Commanders won that trade. They got something out of a core, out of a player that gives you nothing. And I'm not saying that metaphorically or figuratively. I mean that literally. Chase Young just does his own thing on the field. It makes you even question why the fuck is he starting if he isn't a coachable player. If he is making the wrong decisions when it comes to wrong fits or playing the run, if he's just running up the field and not trying to do anything, like, why do you have this guy starting? You see, the reason why Kansas City has been able to surprise everybody and make it to the Super Bowl once again when it looks like they were down and out despite not having a talented team is because of one thing. They don't beat themselves. They're consistent. They're well coached. And they give you everything they got every time they take the field. You can't say the same thing for the 49ers when you're cheating your coach. The NFC Championship, the game before the Super Bowl, your effort gets called into question? Playing in the Super Bowl isn't enough for you? You see, when you're going up against Patrick Mahomes, you better be ready. You better not have any effort issues. If you put Chase Young out there, which you will need him out there just because of his athleticism alone, he's so athletic that he gives you the best chance of being able to beat Kansas City because when Mahomes gets outside the pocket, he's making magic happen. Way more than what he has done in previous years. So you need a quarter, you need an edge rusher like Chase Young, athletic enough to drag this dude down. But if you're questioning his effort and the dude doesn't know the plays or he's just freelancing out there doing his own thing, then he's just a liability. I mean, you got Fred Warner and you got Traverius Ward and Nick Bosa, but you really need these, these three cornerstones of your defense to have a standout game. Like, this has to be some of the best games that these players have ever had on the 49ers defense. Under Steve Wilkes, because when D'Amico Ryans was the defensive coordinator, we never saw problems with effort, players freelancing and doing their own thing. This defense has to show up against Patrick Mahomes in Kansas City, because if they don't, then this thing could be looking embarrassing at halftime, and it can be looking embarrassing when the final whistle gets blown. It doesn't matter if Kansas City's offense has struggled during the regular season, so has your defense. This offense looks completely different in the playoffs than what they did in the regular season. The 49ers shouldn't be having these issues about effort and who they are as a defense and not being able to play up to the level of talent that they have in the Super Bowl. At this point, your identity should be set. Who you are is what you are. It's too late in the year to be having these questions about the 49ers' effort on defense. Are they going to get everything out of their players. This is the fucking Super Bowl. You're going up against Mahomes. If you don't want it, you don't deserve to be there. They shouldn't have even won that game if their defense wasn't giving it all they have for a shot at the Super Bowl on the line. I don't believe this defense is going to show up against Kansas City. Kansas City, I believe it scores at least 28 points, maybe 30. This isn't a defense that you can trust. I can trust Kansas City's defense. I don't see problems with effort. I did against the Detroit Lions for the 49ers. They got shredded by Jordan Love. A young quarterback in his first ever postseason game owned them. It was embarrassing. Like Jordan Love was doing whatever he wanted. And you can say your defense showed up late in the game and won it. But 
Are they going to be able to do the same against Patrick Mahomes? Can you trust this defense to get a stop late in the fourth quarter if Mahomes has the ball last and needs to engineer a game-winning drive to get the Super Bowl? Can you trust your defense in that situation? I can't. The 49ers' lack of effort is really concerning. It isn't just something that people should look over. And I don't believe it's going to be something that just all of a sudden it changes because it's the Super Bowl. Who you are at this time of the season is what you are. It's too late in the season for you all of a sudden to become something that you aren't. If you are showing a lack of effort in the NFC Championship, that shows me a lot about who you are as a defense. Can't trust you against Patrick Mahomes. Love you, but can't trust you guys against Patrick Mahomes, one of the greatest quarterbacks ever.